everybody and welcome back to my channel um, before we hop into this video if you haven't already please go below and subscribe to my channel and join our family um, so let's hop right into it ladies we all know we've been there done that being cheated on it hurts so bad it takes a piece out of you it makes you feel like you're less than and you actually sometimes compromise what God and who God told you you are because of that self-esteem issue that you 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 took on when you were cheated on because you felt like well maybe if I did this and I did this better then it would have worked or he would not have did what he did um and sometimes that's not the case sometimes God take us through certain situations to prepare us for the next I truly believe that. I truly believe that everything sometimes we go through in life is for a reason. And I just want to encourage you ladies, if you're going through this situation, keep your head up. Do not doubt yourself. You're beautiful. Do not doubt who God said you are because of somebody else's insecurities and foolishness, honestly. Um, a lot of times, and we, whenever we fall short to something like that, we have to be able to forgive that person and to be delivered from that situation because we'll take it over into the next relationship. And trust me, I've been there, done that. I've been married now for three years, going on four years this year. And in the beginning of our relationship, I honestly had some issues I didn't even know I was still dealing with from previous people. And, you know, it took my husband pointing things out to me that I, were, I was doing and just thinking that he's cheating and he's not because of the pattern that I went through in my life. So that's why a lot of times you have to forgive and for, don't forget, but forgive people like that, that hurt you in the past because it's just going to eat you alive. And a lot of times when you're in a marriage, um, if you're going through a situation in marriage, please have open communication. Open communication will help your marriage if you're not being satisfied if you if you want to try different things when it comes to sex tell your mate your partner whoever you're with you need to tell tell them because that's how a lot of times we crave things and we're wa wanting things because we're not being fulfilled in our marriage because of the communication you haven't talked about it so you can't expect someone to know what you like until you have a conversation about it so that's definitely another thing whenever it comes to being cheated on and just having a healthy relationship, make sure to keep that communication open. So that's just some tips that I want to tell you and just being cheated on back to that. Ladies, do not question yourself. Don't allow people to bring down your self-esteem. You're beautiful. You know, you're God's creation. You're made in the image of God. So don't let, never let another human being take that innocence away from you to think that you're less than what you are. I mean, I've been there and I've done that. I've been depressed. And I'm going to get into that in another video because that's a whole nother thing. Like, just life beats you down sometimes to where you're even depressed about situations. And we can't, we're, we're beautiful creatures and we have to accept who we are, flaws and all, accept everything about you, love everything about yourself because who else is going to do it? If nobody else loves yourself, who else is going to do it better than me? And I'm not going to come here long with you guys, you know, with this, but I just wanted to come on here really quickly and just encourage whoever that's going through the situation right now, keep your head up. You're beautiful. If nobody else tells you you're beautiful, I'm telling you that you're beautiful. And if you need, if you women or even men need encouragement, please comment or try to reach me somehow. I will give you my information if you need anybody to, to talk to. And, you know, just, just to have that person in the ear or just to write on Facebook, whatever. I'm here for you if that's what you need. And I will give you my contact information and everything that you can reach me on Facebook. I'll link it all in the description box below. So you guys, you come on in and join my family. I love you all. And I'll see you in the next video. Be encouraged and be blessed.